Jessica Garcia and her 12-year-old son are being held in separate detention centers in Texas after seeking asylum from Honduras because of gang violence. It's just tragedy after tragedy and they just want to escape that, that's all. Garcia's sister-in-law has written letters pleading with Homeland Security to have them reunited and released. She's also reached out to Senator Jean Shaheen. It's unbelievable, you know, that they would do something like this. At least release Jafet to us or to my sister-in-law, Erica, you know. I don't understand why they're keeping him held. The family has also created an online petition. Right now, there are more than 23,000 signatures. Each time it's signed, another email request is sent to Homeland Security. If we get enough support behind us, there's more reason for them to be released to us while they wait for court date um, and try to get their court moved to Boston. It's heartbreaking. I have two kids and I cannot imagine being separated like that for a single day. Dr. Mohamed Saleh, who is part of a group in Keene working to help local immigrants, says he's doing what he can to help Garcia and her son, and he encourages others to step up and do the same for immigrants in need. I plead to every individual, every citizen of the state and in the nation, if you know someone, step up. One person can make a difference. Now, we did reach out to Senator Jean Shaheen's office to inquire about how they are helping, but because it is an open case, all they could confirm is that they are working on the situation. Live in studio, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.